Hi there. Uh, I have a question about data grep. Um, I'm trying to import inside this uh, blank schema. This is an empty schema. I'm trying to import data from a file. Okay. I'm doing this. Uh, the original file is this one here. This contains the entire information I want to import. Um, and this is my configuration here. Uh, I was wondering why this section is not actually working at the moment. Maybe I'm doing something wrong. Let me show you what I mean. Um, so the original file, let, let's just try to run this one. It's actually importing them now. There we go. And I get this error here. When I open the, the error save, I see this. Oh, wait, let me see here. So on this line, uh, I get an I get an error here. Yeah, it's expecting a uh, I'm using the pipe charter character to separate the values. So I don't know why it's actually expecting to to use double quotes as is. Um, if I if I go directly to this line in the, the file, let me show you something here. There we go. Uh, this is um, a different file I'm using here. Yeah, this is the line I'm working on. So it seems that this section here, the Y, is between double quotes. So it's not actually escaping this character. Um, and I don't know why. After reading the documentation for data grip, uh, this is um, at the moment of running. This section here is supposed to be um, uh, doing this, I guess, escaping the character this way, like that. Uh, yet, data grip is not doing that, I guess. Get it back to place. So, what I'm going to be doing now is I'm going to try to import this file here. Used to be a little bit clearer. So. The table seems to be working. Let's drop this. There we go. Let's try again. I'm going to be using the origin test file. And here I can see that only the second line is going to be imported. Let me change the encoding to Windows so I can actually see the characters correctly. So I don't know why uh, I uh, I'm supposing that this section here allows me to uh, escape the characters, uh, yet it doesn't seem to be doing it. Yeah, I don't know why. I read about that here. Let me show you here. Um, let me see. Escape sequences. I can escape the the double quotes on the on the on the strings. Um, using this escape sequence here, or the second one here. Um, I actually guessing that, uh, let me see here, the quote values, there we go. So on this section here, it says that each line in the area under quotation, um, well, basically here is telling me how um, the mechanics for escaping the double quotes and the single quotes is going to be used. so an escape method or character or uh, for the cases when, well this section here explains how it's actually supposed to escape the quotation in example the escape duplicate means that if a quotation character occurs within a value it is doubled so basically in the case of MariaDB um, these double quotes here, for example, uh, this quote here is going to begin, and these couple quotes are going to be translated into this one here. Uh, this end quote is going to finish the enclosing this value here, and the same here. So I'm going to ignore this one and the last one, and this double quote is going to become this one here. This double quote is going to become this one here. Uh, so my guess is that uh, is for some reason 
data grip is not doing that or I need to do uh, something else. Uh, the things that are different here is that the value separator is a pipe character. That's the first thing, it's a pipe character. Uh, that's different from comma separated values and tab separated values. Um, the quote values, I change that to always. If I change this to when needed, uh, the same happens, so no difference there. And I don't know why it's not actually working. Right here, the same thing. Say that. So if I go back to the original text file here, let's. Um, if I add another double quote here, uh, I believe it um, is not going to do anything. Also. Let's try it again. Cancel. Import data from file. Uh, origin test. Uh, I cannot see the, the row here. Missing one row. If I try to, if I do eliminate this, the file obviously is going to count all of this as a single value. And that way I can actually import it. Import it again. And now I can see the value. So I don't know what I'm doing wrong here. Um, uh, because I can, since this is just a single uh, value here, I can basically change, change uh, it manually without any problems in this case. Uh, my question will be, um, how can I actually uh, use this section here so that when data grid finds a value with double quotes, it actually escapes the, the double quotes or the single quotes correctly. So yeah, I don't, I don't know what I need to do here. Then I already tried so, uh, replacing this by the other escape character and it didn't work. So I don't know what to do then. So that's my stupid question. Uh, I wonder if I'm doing something wrong here and why I cannot escape the value, um, the value, uh, the double quotes in the value. So I may like to know that. Thank you for your time.